Here we go. Here we go. We're going somewhere. Oh, there we go. We're going somewhere. I don't know where it is we're going. I don't know. Things are happening. Yes, it is. It's 8 o'clock, dude. I thought You're wrong. Citizen's arrest. Citizen's arrest. Citizen's arrest. Camp Possum Wednesday night at Camp Possum. You know we're having a great time here. I hope everybody enjoyed didn't the, turn on the, big light. the meal. I hope, I hope everybody enjoyed the meal in the mess hall tonight. Well, we, it seems like we have enough light, but let's see no, what happens I mean, here. This is the light. That's light. Oh, that's better. It fills it. Well, you can turn the that part of that off because that's yeah. like blanching the corner I know, there. It, it All right, ho. So hey, I hope you enjoyed those those beautiful uh, fried fish cakes in the mess hall tonight, and uh, and the ice cream with. With chocolate sauce and the nuts to sprinkle on it. Man, that was good. I really enjoyed that. Old chef, camp chef, did a really good job there tonight. <laughs> so let's get started with playing a tune. I got first, my list. First, we gotta say hi to the people. I get to type in. Well, Pat, say hi to people. We got All time. Right. We got time. Chef We're here for an hour and a half. Chip, Joseph, Jennifer. All right. Hey, she knows Jennifer. Oh, Jennifer. All right, good for her. All right, so there we are. We're all caught up now. What do we play? Okay, well, Alan from Maine is new tonight, I think. I think he is. He's requesting tunes from the Dear Old Illinois That's book, I think. I think. That's what it That's sounds what like. I, I don't play either of those, but we might play them in the future. We have uh, the book. I might play them in the pasture, too. I know we have the book. If I don't play them in the future, I'll play them in the pasture. <laughs> I'm worried. Well, I don't think Helen Edgar is here tonight, so I'm going to hold off on one tune yeah, that I was going to play. Hold off on that. Hi, uh, Warren and Wanda. A nice lady many, named Helen from up in... and Wanda. A nice lady from, named Helen from up in, in uh, New Brunswick has been asking me to play the Four Jacks, and I resurrected it this afternoon. Yeah. Several times she's asked, and tonight's the night, Helen. Uh, hope you show up. Nice You'll night. have to watch the archived version. But let's right now, let's play Boys Around the World in the Key of A. <laughs> It's one of those Missouri Valley tunes, but I think it's actually a Danish polka is my, my take on it. Hey!
wins. No. It wasn't that. <laughs> I don't smell anything. Turn that little fan on, honey. It's already getting hot. I will. I will. Don't, no, don't, 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 all right, so that's a good tune, and I think it is a polka. You know, all those years I spent playing with Cyril and Dwight up in uh, up in the Missouri Valley up there in Iowa, North Missouri, and I was from up in that country, actually. And uh, uh, I didn't realize that all that connection with all that Danish music, you know, Dwight would play a few little tunes on his button accordion, and then our friend Christian Bugga, who I met later on, a younger man than me, but a very ardent follower of Danish music from Daneland, Daneland? Denmark, that's right. So, so we went up with him uh, and, and Bill Peterson to Vibor, South Dakota, and there were the Sons of Denmark Hall, like a Legion Hall, and everybody up in that country is Danish. I thought just Dwight, you know, but there's a whole bunch of Danish people settled up in there. So we heard tune after tune after tune. Man, that's good music, but I think that tune comes from that tradition. That would be my guess. I've never seen it anywhere else. Never. The title is kind of an Anglo sort of, 19th century kind of title, Boys Around the World, but I think that's a Danish thing. <laughs> Truth be known. Yeah. Step the soup and more noodles. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, Helen hasn't reported in yet. So, Helen, are you so out there? It's, Helen it's, from New Brunswick? I want to play the four yeah, jacks. That's a Dwight story. tune. Yeah, that's a yeah. Dwight Lamb tune. Or, well, that's a Cyril and Bob tune. And right. That country. Well, they know. learned it from him. Uh, no, not no, Nissa. No, no, not, not that. that was, a lot of people would have played it then, huh? That's, yeah, that's Cyril played it, and I think he got it from Bob Walters, but you know, that's all up in that country. There were all those people from different parts of Europe up in there. So yep. let's play another one off my list. You know, I, go, I, I got the list here. I always have this list of 10 starter tunes to keep things rolling along, but we'll play some of your requests too as we time moves on. Let's play a little bit of that Acorn Hill breakdown. Key of D? Key of D. Key not too fast. Not too fast. Because if people well, know, some, some people are tired of slow jamming. I was told. Yeah, but we're not going to play it slow jam speed. Oh, we uh, never but, uh, do that. We'll play it so that other people can join in. I, I who said, know, who you know, know the tune. The, the slowest we go is about one ten. Yeah. And the absolute slowest. I tried to play it a hundred the other day, and, and I, the tune I can't promise fell completely. That we can even get down to one ten. So Tommy Jackson tune called Acorn Hill Breakdown. Here we go. My cake, uh, my cake picture in the. In it's the, not there. I don't have it on the list. No, because after I crashed a while back, I didn't put everything back. You know. Oh. So I got to put the cake back in. Happy birthday, Pete! Bye, bye, Cracky! Happy bye, birthday, Cracky! Ball. 
Mm. That's a heck of a good tune there, I'm telling you right now. Jeff, Marinelle, Kim, Pete, Jennifer, Kim, uh, John, John Williams, yeah, yeah. Yep, John P's here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Roger knows his ice cream. a special meme for your birthday, Pete, but it wasn't <laughs> shareable. <laughs> oh, that, that's a mean meme. Oh, you guys. It's a mean meme. <laughs> Woo wee. All right, well, yeah. you know, what, what are you going to do? No. You know, wait, usually Helen Helen contacts me through Facebook Messenger. She's one of the few people that during the show. I can contact her. Well, I, I sent her a message. Say, hey, we're playing I, the Four Jacks. I sent her a message. Her we're, we'll, have, we'll play it here in just a little bit. I think after this next tune, we're going to play the Four Jacks because I have to keep it I, Leon, Juanita. in my mind. Oh, Lee and Juanita. J we're Janita. Janita. Oh, really? Yes. Janita. Because yes. my... My nephew is married to Juanita, which right, is from Puerto Rico. That's why you messed up that's why the Juanita I messed up. part. But it's close. But it's, well, yeah. It's just one, it's one, one letter missing. It's the same. <laughs> <laughs> okay. um, All right, let's play a little bit of uh, Aunt Mary's Horn Vibe. Oh, this is the one they can play along with, eh? This, it is, because well, this is a Camp a? Possum Saturday tune. D. Yeah, D. But well, you know, when the Canadians call their, their tune switches, they just yell, but it's not an A. No, they just say it's like the A, a. like E H question mark. You know the A. Yeah. A A, a? like that. No, it's I thought we were gonna play in D. An that confused us one time. <laughs> oh my! We were playing with the Schreier boys. That, that, messed, that messed us all up. Yeah. All right, so it's a uh, one that goes like this. You know, I'm gonna turn the volume up here just a little bit. Don't, don't watch your ears. Watch your ears. I'm gonna turn the volume up just a little bit because I think it's a little light. Okay. Think so? Yeah, it was. It was a little light. All right, here All right. we go. Here we go. Slow down a little. Yeah, 140 beats a minute it has to be, right? Well, <laughs> well, yeah, but yeah. People ask to play slow, ask us callers to play slow and then slower. Finally, I pleaded, we can't play slower than 105. We just can't. Now you want? Now you you're gonna chat chat with people a little bit. I'll talk. I'll talk. Let okay, me run. My, I run my mouth here. You okay. know, I might ask Pat a question though. She went to Girl Scout camp many times, didn't you? Sure. Up. Now what happens if you go to camp enough years? What, what do they usually do after so many years have gone by and you've become a reliable camper? What do they sometimes do, Pat, at camp? You told me to read the stuff. Okay. What? Well, they make you a counselor. Well, maybe. They might make you a counselor. Or they might throw you out. But people have come. I'm trying to pl plug your oh, buttons. Oh, okay. All right. Got it. <laughs> Wake up. I Wake up. Smell the, smell the coffee. All right. So we made, Pat and Jesse made camp counselor buttons. And here's what they look like. Yeah, yeah. Here's Jones. what they look like. And they're available at blog.charliewalden.com under Camp Possum Merch. Just click that link. Now, they're $5 a piece. But if you're a patron, 
at patreon.com forward slash Charlie Walton. They're two for five. So you can actually, this one might be an opportune time if you wanted two of Pat's wonderful new buttons. You could basically get a button for free. You can you, write your own name in and there. Yeah, you can write your own name. Well, you can say, it's on the picture. You can right. see our names are written it's right blank. on there. So if you're interested in those, go to blog.charliewalton.com and click the Camp Possum merch button and get yourself a Camp Counselor button. You all have graduated. You've been to Camp Possum yeah. enough times. You've you, been there. You deserve to be a counselor now. Yeah. All right, so... By the way, by the way, but, but not nice only buttons. was I a Boy Scout leader and spent a week at Camp Kajuan with the Boy Scouts, you were the Scout Master. For years. For a long time. For, for, now the Scout Master... Boys. Yeah, for two boys, it lives two houses that way, so we're keeping it all on the block, you know. I must have been a scoutmaster for like seven years or we something. We gave them seven of our hatchets last summer. Right, we gave them <laughs> pet, most of the stuff that was in our attic, they have now. So. Hi, Susan. But yeah, I like, uh, I like being in Boy Scouts. That yes, you got I'll, I'll do Texas whenever I can. Okay, so I think it's time to play the uh, Four Jacks. We're going to play it anyway. Helen's not here, but it's a good tune. It's, uh, We're going to do it even though Helen isn't here? Yeah, we'll do it. We can do it another time for it. We're going to play the Four Jacks. It's kind of a ragtime, two-steppy kind of tune. You'll like it. Uh, I'll put the music, I'll dot it out and put the music up for you. It's in, I got found it in a Don Messer book so Pat could have the chords, but I kind of I do it in my I head. I think but I might need Because we play it up They're at, so small, we I'm play not going to be at, able to see them. We play it up at Pembroke because they like it up there. But, oh, they love it. But Don... Don Messer recorded it, but I think it's actually a tune from the 1800s. I think if I if you look on the Library of Congress site for the old sheet music, I think you'll find the Four Jacks as an old But there's some song. of Mary Poppins in there. Oh, yeah, it's a little bit of... Spoonful of sugar helps some medicine. It does that at one point. That's, that's, what, that's how we remembered how it went. That's how I remember the Four Jacks. But so here we go with the Four Jacks. Let's try a little bit of it, see what happens. Oh, Faye knows this, yep. I don't think... Oh, hi, Faye. I don't think I know Faye. And, so, and it's a tune that Bob Christensen really would have liked a lot, too. You tell me if you, you don't think this would have been... This has been right up his alley, right there with when you wore a tulip and I wore a big red rose. It's in that same vein.
couple Brownies. clunkers at the end. <laughs> got a couple clunkers at the end, but that's okay. That's a lot of tune there. That's a lot of tune. It's a good one. The four jacks. I will just ear cope. Yeah, y'all have to ear cope for now on that one. Oh, you should have seen me the first time they played that in Canada when I was there. Uh, and didn't give like, you any music. What? What is this? <laughs> what is this tune? Where's it go? It's got the Tennessee Waltz chord in there, too. It's got everything. It's got everything. It's got it all. Yeah. It's a complete package. Absolutely. Yes, it is a spoonful of sugar. <laughs> I kicked out of Boy Scouts. <laughs> Yeah, I won't. I yeah, don't, well. I don't say why you got kicked out of Boy Scouts. That's a really bad, inappropriate joke if you say well, that. Well, Faye knew it. I don't know if anybody else knew that. But you know, <laughs> he's an Eagle Scout. And once you're an Eagle Scout, you're always an Eagle well, Scout. Well, you can get drummed out, I think. You can. But can? <laughs> well, sure. You can get drummed out of anything. <laughs> of course, I'm probably proof you can't get drummed out. But, uh, <laughs> Play a little bit of. Uh, oh yeah, Kim said she ordered her buttons. You were the first one, Kim. Kim Spaulding, yeah, she's yeah, already ordered first her buttons. One. So. She was on it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's play. Uh, let's play us a jig. Yeah, it's lots of chords. They're not that complicated, but they're unexpected. Or what, are we have any good requests? Here? Let's see if we got any requests. Here we want to try to do. No, no, I don't think we have any requests. People are yet. just listening to the. Listen, yeah, they're just it's settling a very in. Long tune. They're settling in. They're settling they're in. They're settling in. All right. Yeah. All right, let's play a little bit of that. Just their instruments too Tom much. McCormick's jig. See, this is a tune they play up in your country, Kim Harris. Tom McCormick's. idea what it was going to do to end that, but that, it stopped. That what, did we learn that from Fish Family? No, Those that's a, uh, no, that's a. Uh, I learned it, I think I did, because no, they're the not, ones that put it's the not, it's diminished not, and augmented chords in it. But it's not on their record. It's not? No, I'm sure, that, that, I'm sure that's from a Joe Cormier record or something. Well, like whoever, I heard, I learned it from, you know, they use all, you know, you're, you're amazed how many times you can put diminished and augmented chords in. Demented chords. And then. Then you realize you could fit them in all kinds of tunes, except if they're Missouri, then they scream. Right, then we look at you, yeah. scance, scance. Then you get the, yeah, the uh, evil harmonic eye. Harmonic ending, yes. <laughs> 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 hey, you know, earlier some people were saying, it's hump day, hump day, blah, blah, blah. You can't say that. And, and, I, I, and on my end, YouTube was tagging your comments as potentially <laughs> you know, inappropriate. So <laughs> just say, hey, it's Wednesday, that's probably better. I, I let them through, but I 
Some you don't realize I see I have on my screen I can hide or show some of your comments just so you Oh he's all <laughs> powerful people Oh man it's like being the Wizard of, Wizard of Oz here. <laughs> all right. All right. So is I think we Tom got the, we got the gray Tom eagle Mac. and top. Which one is it? Tom Mac. Tom Mac McCormick. M A C. M A C. Okay. So it's M A C. We have requests coming in. All right. Gray eagle, talk to Dinah. Oh well, that's because I said that. But oh, yeah. Yeah. We can play the. Gee, he says he's an eagle scout. Oh, that does not surprise me one little he bit. He says was no. You're, if you're an eagle scout, Gene, you're always an eagle scout. You're gonna die an eagle scout. Period. <laughs> Yeah. Well, we'll have to exchange Eagle Scout, uh, you know. Stories. Stories, yeah. <laughs> Let's play that Talk to Dinah. How about that? Sure. Hey. These chords sound like a great piano for duffers topic, she said. Well, you know, <laughs> well, it is. You know, I've got lots of ideas. You know, you don't have to do for duffers. You could just do pets. Well, no. I'm going to do duffers, but I'm also... You should do give away some of the secret juice. Specialty tunes <laughs> that reveal all the chord substitutions. The secret juice. That's, yeah, that's her secret, secret juice. juice. She doesn't like... She Whenever I give her a... T uh, like, I'll write some music out, and I'll say, here, put the chords in. She says, I'm not putting my secret juice on this page. It's okay, just put the simple chords. I don't care. <laughs> She's holding back from everybody, folks. No, no, it's just the stuff that I made up myself. I'll teach everything I learned from everybody else. <laughs> you know what we're playing? You know what's coming? I'm going to tell you what's coming up because there's things coming up, you know. I don't know if you're interested or not, but I'm going to tell you anyway. Tomorrow is backup guitar for Duffers starting at 11 o'clock a.m. Come on in. We're on. We're up to lesson number. We might be up to lesson number eight. In fact, wow, I think we are up to lesson number eight maybe. That's, that's a, no, so that's still six. We're up to eight on. We're going to be up to eight on fiddle. So that's lesson number six. Tomorrow, guitar backup for Duffers. Then on Friday night, it's the Big Fiddle Show number 71. Our special guests are Who? Mark Wardenberg from, really? from out in Silicon Valley. The guy right. is an incredible fiddle player, and he put together this really wild video. He did? <laughs> yeah, that's really wild. Mark's a, I can believe Mark's that. a techie and a fabulous musician, yeah, so you're going to like it. And yeah. he's the guy, sometimes in my little advert role, you see Tater Joe's. He's he's the guy who does that website. You'll get to see Mark play Friday night. What and also, does he do? Tater Joe's. Oh, it's a, you probably told me. I didn't realize I'm sure. Because I don't spend all my time looking at websites like some people. <laughs> and so, uh, then John Williams played us another wall. So you get to hear him all play right, on Friday night as well. And I've got so many good videos in the tank now. I'm going to start putting out... I'll put out the teasers, you know, on the upcoming episodes. Who's playing on upcoming episodes? Because it, it, it's a well, it's a cavalcade of stars, as I often say, you know. Well, yeah, and I can give you a hint on the question. Well, hang the on. Prize. Oh, the prize. Yeah, the prize is the picture I, I, I can of give you a hint. The category is things you probably didn't learn in school, but you might have liked. That's the category. That's, that doesn't tell you much. That's good. That's yeah, it. you're gonna win the picture of the aqua possum <laughs> if you win the contest. And then on on uh, Saturday it's Camp Possum at eleven o'clock, eleven to twelve thirty. We're gonna learn the silver and gold two step, and we're gonna play that right now. We are. Yeah, of course we are. We're I thought you were gonna play Request. You said no, we were playing I've, Talk to Dinah. We are, but I'm gonna play. I decided I'd rather play this <laughs> tune. It, I, honey, in in entertainment, it's all about the segues in a broadcast. You have to have your segues, you see. So I'm segueing. But Jennifer, we will get back to Talk to Dinah. It's in D. Pie. All right, so, and a lot of people know this already, but we're, it's John White used to play it all the time. We've got a nice version. No, so in D, we're silver fine. and gold two step.
regular length, Jerry? Yeah, it's regular length. It, it, irregular. It, no, it's regular length. It's regular sure? length. Yeah, it comes out. Yeah, I, I, so I, sure. I read it out. I read it out. I am not. I got, do I have it here? No, I don't. Yeah, it's been in your head all week. I don't have it here. <laughs> do, 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 Sorry. Do, do. Hey, you know what? Uh, you know what? When you buy a sticker or buy any merchandise or become a patron, oh my God. we're able to is get this new hardware. We're gonna get new. No, is it's not it ready? ready. This is a new piece of hardware I have. Thank you, and, Lucky Stars. And it has eight buttons that I can program to play crazy sounds at the touch of a button. I will not allow certain. Well, I'm thinking bodily sounds. <laughs> a lot of bodily sounds that, that can be played. Bodily sounds. <laughs> I, I, have you, you ever listened? Back. to... It's like drive. It's gonna be like drive time radio Friday night here, you know. You know that kind of thing. So be ready, cause that's so your 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 contributions to the program have purchased this. I just want you to know when you buy a sticker or join our Patreon.com forward slash Charlie Walden. This is the kind of thing that can happen. So thank you a lot, everybody. Thank thank you. <laughs> Pat, where'd you go? Pat, where are you going? It's not break time. It's not break time. No, it's not break time. Girl, it's not break time. It should leave for a sec. All right, but Parson, right. I'm going to have veto power on <laughs> some of those sounds. <laughs> yeah. Laugh track. I can do laugh track. Applause. I can do, you know, the, the sad trumpet. <laughs> Rim shot. You know. It's a trombone. Well, so whatever it is, whatever. It's a sad trombone. trombone. Sad rim shot. <laughs> Boom. I, maybe I'll get. I think I got rim shots left over from when Jeff played the drums for us. I might use. I might use some Jeff. Uh, Jeff Seitz drum parts because I've got those all oh, separated out. Oh, yeah, definitely. There'll be so a Jeff Seitz button. So you know that Jeff is an excellent drummer. Oh, he's a fantastic drummer. What are you oh, talking yeah. about? <laughs> you got a Kaylee band in St. Louis and you need a drummer. He's your man. He's the guy. I think he's I've recommended him to people before actually on that yeah. very score. Okay, so regular length <laughs> means, you know. Comes out. 16 bars, 32 bars. It comes out. Yeah, it comes out. But I, I could have sworn that second part you only played it once. Mm -hmm. well, well, I'll cut it out. I'll let you know, folks. All right, so folks, hey. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's play. Uh, let's play another tune. Let's say we got on, on, on my short list. Oh, oh no, we're gonna play. It's a fog machine and sound activated lights. We pay the shipping and handling. Are you kidding me? In a minute, we would do that. I have a fog machine and sound. In a minute. <laughs> oh, yeah, we'll we'll, we'll talk. In a minute, we'll talk. We'll that could be. Going. We'll have to use it outdoors, though. We can have a. We can have a backyard episode. You have no idea what I do for Halloween here. You have no idea. Yeah, we'll we'll uh, we'll uh, it's we'll talk. It's legendary. People come for blocks around to our house. <laughs> blocks. No, oh. we're not retiring citizens' arrest, but we're just adding to citizens' arrest. Well, but we could do it. Right there. There you go. Just like Taylor McBain, he said, everything in the Civil War yeah. happened in threes. I don't we don't know why. It's like a Masonic thing, I think. I don't know. Hi, Lynn. Never figured out why. Lynn's here. Oh, Lynn, hey, what's going on? All right. What are we going to play? We're going to play a little bit of uh, well, Talk to Dinah. Yes. Yeah. And then we'll play the Gray Eagles. We, we didn't quite hit it. We didn't break down, but we didn't quite hit I, it. I, so we still have to do the 10. We'll cut in a, Maybe in a month we'll try the, the 10 is, again. He's got the yips. You've got the yips on top to die. I know. I can't start it. It's like yeah, he's got the can't, yips. can't get it going. I can start it when it's by itself. Oh yeah. But I can't change to it. Thank you. 
That's that a song. good tune. That's a good tune. Pete, Pete could play that. I don't know. Ever, I never heard anybody else play. <laughs> we'll use tune. that sticker money. Yeah, we're we'll gonna use the sticker the money. Pay the shipping. Pay the shipping. Oh, money. no problem. No problem. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Like I say, we'll talk to. We'll talk. <laughs> <laughs> Is there such a thing as a retiring citizen's arrest? I don't know if there's... No, no. Dummy. <laughs> anyway. No, 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 no. Oh, I like that. Marion told talk, turned us on to a tune the other day, too. Wilfred Laurier's... Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, remember that tune? And Marion is now going to be knitting for John Whalen. And if it's just rectangles, Marion, I can do that, too. So, you know. <laughs> but I could only knit you rectangles. You should continue email. I'm not very good. Do, do costume the email and pictures for special have... Halloween. Oh, yes. Oh, oh, yeah, special have, Halloween slideshow. That's no a good idea. idea. Wait, yeah, the That's graveyard. I do a different themed graveyard in front of the house. We have spooky music blasting from the front windows you can hear for three blocks. Yeah, we'll, You have no idea. We'll, we'll start doing. taking Halloween pictures the 1st of October, I think. I don't want to get them. We don't have I don't anybody now, with a chainsaw running from the bushes, which is what they did over on Lincoln yeah, Avenue. They'll, they'll, they had to stop that. <laughs> now they said, get your shots. <laughs> <laughs> Pete and Nancy. No, I don't know Pete and Nancy. Alan, where's that come I from? I'm not sure. What, what? Pete, and Pete and Nancy. You play, I don't know that That's tune. That's a tune. That's a tune. I didn't. I never heard of those it. Those are people. Right. I know Pete and I know Pete and Kelly. I know a Pete and a Nancy. Sorry, I don't know that tune. Maybe, maybe uh, I tell you what, Alan. Why don't you message me? Yeah. Message me at. Big Fiddle Show at gmail.com. That's a that's see that's what they call a segue in the business pat. Alan message me at bigfiddleshow at gmail.com and send me those requests. If you got little MP3s you can send me to that address. And I'll put you on our mailing list too, whether you want to be or not. No, I'm just kidding. I'll put you on our mailing list to get our newsletter. Anybody else who wants to be on the newsletter, please uh, email me at bigfiddleshow at gmail.com. All right, so uh, let's play another tune. I think we had the gray eagle request. We did. We'll play the one in A. Well, that's the only one you play. No, well, there's a C. Gray I know, eagle. but do you play the one in C? We'll play that one first, then we'll play the one in C. So get your fiddles up and get into D. Whatever <laughs> instrument you're playing, we're going to play in D. <laughs> uh, yeah. 
Yeah, Alan, I don't play a lot of those. Uh, Who's Joe Samo? Joe Samajedney. Oh. You must have lived here in Chicago for a yeah, while you, if you're in Maine. If you know, but, yeah, you But must. Uh, I don't play a lot of those dear old Illinois tunes. I'm getting exposed well, to a few book. of them. I do have the book, but I, I'm getting exposed to a few I of them. I'm a great friends with the Harrisons. Right. Yeah, Cliff got me playing a few of those yeah. a while back. So. All right, let's try a little bit of uh, Zach Wheat's piece, shall we? In D. We're going to play Zach Wheat's piece, and then we're going to play Turkey in the Straw. After that, not as a medley. Okay. All right, here we go. What key are we in? We're in D. This is a Camp Possum Saturday tune, too, by the way. That's a good one, isn't it? That's oh, a good tune. You know, it's it time to roll. Good. It's time for the old patron roll, the patron oh. credit roll. We're going to play, we we'll always play Turkey in the Straw. All right, Alan's from a city north of Vernon Hills, and we know all about Vernon Hills. Yep, yep. Yep, yep. Pete and Nancy were mules. That's what Lynn says. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, she probably don't. Well, I know, no, it's probably, that's the story, I'm, I'm sure. sure. it's true. It's one the of those boys. from those, Fletcher. Those boys collected all, they collected yeah. stories too. So, uh, Pete Many and Nancy were mules. Made at Rambling House. Yes, yes. <laughs> so, get ready to play Turkey in the Straw, folks. Get ready. Oh, is that what we're doing? Yeah, get ready. Gee. A couple times through. Here we go. Get ready to go. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs>
so now you know all those good people and our patrons at patreon.com forward slash Charlie Wolf. Go check it out. Bye, bye, Cracky. Go check it out. All right, so now it's oh. time to take a break. Well, okay. It's time to take a short oh, break. Oh, yeah. Ellen says she remembers this from the, the dances at, in Libertyville Hall. Oh, gosh, yeah. That, man, that's man. a long time that ago. Was. That's a great hall. That's a great, wonderful that building, yeah. That is a great hall. Yeah. Pete and Nancy is 101. Okay. Oh, in dear old Illinois. I knew it had to be in that book. All right. Good I evening, Thomas. Thomas. Good I evening. Thomas. <laughs> Better late than never, buddy. But you're just in time for the break. So we're gonna take we're gonna take a short break and we'll be right back in less than five minutes. This video lasts Where are we going? We're taking a short break. Oh we're going somewhere? So yeah, I'm gonna refill my beverage <laughs> and people might wanna, you know, go have a wee or something. Yeah. <laughs> you know. Okay, we'll All come right. back. We'll, we'll be back. Four we'll less be back. Than, it's four and a half minutes. We'll be back in four and a half minutes. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, now a short intermission, so you'll have time to make your selection before the show begins. Show starts in five minutes. Popcorn, candy, ooh, hot dog, popsicles. Oh boy! Oh boy, fan of orange. Show starts in four minutes. Sneaking out to the drive-in? Why not take the kiddies along and save the expense of a sitter? Everyone enjoys the drive-in. Give the demonstration of my new invention, the goodies machine. The machine turns out delumptious hot doggies one after the other. And thirst quenching sodas also. Gives popcorn of the most tasty kind, plain and buttered. Candy too, crunchy and dandy. Steaming hot coffee and ice cream too. These goodies are at a snack bar just waiting for you. Mmm. <laughs> Show starts in three minutes. Can I buy a new cutlass now? Sure handles easy. Drive happy, cutlass can make you a little drive happy. <laughs> I forgot to get the new Just one, two, three. Is this thing on? Is this thing on? Glad we ordered these swivel bucket seats. Is this thing on? Is this thing on? In case I get to drive hey. someday. The Cutlass S, Oldsmobile Sporty Fastback, at a price that's less than you might think to help make you really drive happy. That's, those, those adverts are of uh, people who've been, appeared on the show or otherwise. Go start in two minutes. They've got an advert there. Refreshment talk. Yep. And our refreshment stand is loaded right. with good things to eat. We're back already? I've got my advert. I've got my advert coming. Just wait for it. Wait for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lots of candy. Wait for it. It's weird. And frosty, refreshing, oh, cold it's weird. drinks. Why not treat yourself at the refreshment oh, center right. now? I'm telling you, it's weird. Here it comes. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? <laughs> At our refreshment stand, your wish is our command. So the coffee we serve there is pure perfection. Here it comes. We're now just one minute away from the beginning of our next feature. Enjoying tonight's broadcast? Go buy us a cup of coffee at co-fee.com forward slash big oh, to the show. Look, watch this part. You missed the good part. I did. They missed it. Mm, that's good. I wanted to call ants. <laughs> I just want people to see that. That's one of my best advert Please. productions. Please drive carefully. And All right, we're back. That's one of my best productions ever, I'm telling you right now. <clears throat> <laughs> Woo! 
Okay, <clears throat> let's play a little bit of the rock and chair <laughs> jig. Do I have any other requests here I need to handle? Uh, I don't think I do right now, so let's play a little bit of the rock and chair uh -huh. jig. Let I see. What are you saying, dear? Uh, C, C, C. C. Remember that one? Yeah. playing Tom McCormick's. That's because There's, I put that chord in there. Oh, that. that's I'm what so I, sorry. something I'm something so ran. Sorry. I, I, because it, you could do that. But it doesn't really go. No, in that but you tune. could. Yeah, but, 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 I didn't, but you should. I stopped it, after a while. Because it doesn't really go. That's what made me wander off onto that other tune, isn't it? It's always my fault. It's <laughs> always my well, fault. Well, no, you gave me that hint, and then they're, because they're close. They're cl similar to well, those parts. Well, they're both in C. No, those parts are close together. That close. They're not that close. Oh, they are. <laughs> no, they're very distinctive in my mind. Uh -huh. Yeah, you couldn't even start it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're distinctive, all right. Mm. All right, here we go, kids. I don't know what paint Simon shot his shoes. Thomas, I got no idea what that is. What was Pete the name of that tune? Pete Simmons Shottish. I don't know that one. What was the name of the tune we just played? Oh, that was the rocking chair jig. Rocking chair jig. Rocking right. chair jig. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> no, that, I don't know Pete C. Simmons, Shottish. I'd like to learn it though. Send me a send send me a a, a file. I don't think I have that one in my or, collection of music. Yeah, so where where we can find it? If you if you suggest a tune and we don't know it, send me a file. Because we don't have the lifeline yet. We can play it at. That's right. I don't have a lifeline. We will have a lifeline. Well, but it won't do any good if I don't know it for them. It's True. not a matter of trying to remember. It's a matter of <laughs> learning it. That's True. that's a different issue. True. But so yeah, yeah send, if you if you suggest a tune and I come up empty, send it. Send me the dots or send me the uh, send me the, a little MP3 of yourself playing it or someone else playing. Right. It. Now he wants to hear Casey Jones and Kim Harris crossing. Casey the Jones. Oh, Casey we Jones. Know Casey Jones and both and crossing the Mitch. No, you're thinking of Casey's horn pipe. I'm not. You mean the Casey Jones was a. No, he, no, he I don't know a tune, fiddle tune called Casey Jones. I think it was. I thought there was. I do not know one. I know Casey's Hornpipe. Casey's Hornpipe. He'll let us know if it's the same thing or not. We're crossing the Minch. Yes, we can do that again. Yeah, okay. I love that one. That's in D. I know the X-rated lyrics to Casey Jones are fabulous, too. <laughs> but I can't do them here on YouTube. I'll get kicked off forever. Oh, no, no. There was a two. Oh, no, sorry. That's Pete Simon's Shottish. Oh, from it's from Casey, Casey Jones. Fiddler. Thank you. The Fiddler. Thank you. Right. Pete's, we okay. got it now. You know, yeah. you know, Dwight used to say when he was in the Army, he said they had an old sergeant and they'd be out. Do it. They never went on maneuvers. I think he was stationed in France during the Korean War. But maybe during his basic training, there was some old sergeant that said, Now, everybody, Simonize your watches. <laughs> Instead of synchronize, he'd say, 
Simonize your watch. Of course, a lot of people, younger people, don't know what it means to simonize they something. Know, and they don't know about synchronizing your watches. <laughs> they don't either. know what a watch is. Well, because that was a Timex ad, too. Syn synchronize your Fitbit. Yeah, well, not was. all watches could be synchronized. You know, they don't have the button on to synchronize. Well, you can do it manually. You can't. If you're really doing, like, synchronizing well, your watch, you have to I have mean, a thing that clicks it in. It's not a military thing you can just do it but you know? no if you're on a some kind of you know secret oh. commando mission or something like okay bill pete simon shottish dwight lamb 80 cd okay good all right good i i have that okay i'll look it up well, we can find it good yeah i have that Simonized. record thank you p uh, uh and bill thank you bill yeah and we'll right. simonize that <laughs> simonize your fitbit that's what they'd say now all right, what are we going to play oh, here? Set your, he sent his Fitbit back. No, I didn't, actually. I kept it. You told me you sent it back. Uh, no, it was not sent back. Mm -hmm. D. the minch it is it's a good this not much to it but it's fun dude to play it's really fun and that's crossing the minch or mcnab's hornpipe jennifer that's right, correct it McNabb's is hornpipe i think old in scotland <laughs> they call it crossing the minch so please <laughs> a, a farm wall? Oh, he must be formal former boss of my priest that, that thanks what is this tune this is the this it's uh yeah. it's crossing the minch the crossing i think the minch. That, i think they figured that oh <laughs> Banks needed simulation models. I'm Maybe sorry, the, what? The fiddle to the banks? Oh, Michael will tell us. Let's play that. Uh. <laughs> I love the tune, Tom, a cousin of Brush Forks of. Brushy Forks of something, yes. Mm hmm. Nailed it. You nailed it. How about oh, a little Dundee's. bit? Dundee. Yeah, that's good. That's Dundee's. good. Sure, let's do that. Let's do that. Is that D2? It's in D. D? Yeah. What the Dundee's horn type? One Cleo Persinger used to play, but I think, uh, and Cyril played it too, I think. So that one. Thank you. 
funny happened. Uh, it almost fell apart. It was me? No, it almost fell apart. Yeah, because sometimes he goes, ha ha, when I throw out an Irish chord. Ha ha, ha ha. And he goes nuts when I throw out an Irish chord. Ha ha. But I didn't throw in he -he. any Irish chords. I didn't. Sure you didn't, dear. <laughs> dear. I didn't. You know, one other one's on our big list here is the <laughs> Lamplighter's Hornpipe in A. Lamplighter's Hornpipe. Uh, uh, oh, uh, people. Yeah, Jennifer nailed it. Woohoo, Kim. Got it for a while, she says. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Woo! What's the lamplighter saying? A. A. Okay, we're saying A. Oh, funny. Well, that one was in D, you know. Maybe that one was wrong. I don't know. Maybe that's what was wrong. You, you're, you're playing I an A. I have no clue. How was it? Two tunes were both straight out of coals. <laughs> they were straight out of coals. She says it's an unreasonable tune. <laughs> That's a fun tune to play. Cyril used to play that. He oh, really yeah. tore that up, man. He played it's, about twice as fast. It is as a that great thing. tune. Yeah. I don't know. You know, another one here on our list, Franz, is uh, <laughs> is swinging on a gate. Oh, that's a good. That's a good tune. That's an Irish tune, I think. They play it up in New England a lot. I've heard it up oh, in Canada yeah. a little bit too. Yeah. In G, swing it's it a on huge a gate. Big, dance big contra dance tune, yeah, yeah. One time, Ross could play the whole thing on guitar, melody and everything. Remember? That yes, I do. Montana I recall Bell that. Cap? I recall that. Who was that guitarist? Uh, uh, he was so good. Yes, he Mike Dowling. Is. Mike Dowling. Yeah, he was. Yeah. Yeah, he was from Du Bois, yeah. Wyoming. Oh, that's why I'm so Are far off. I am now. It wasn't before. At least one string has to be in tune. Right. And it wasn't. They, none of them were. <laughs> there wasn't one that was in tune with itself. Okay, now we're better. All right, swing in on a gate in the key of G.
teenager in love. <laughs> you know that. Everybody knows that. Why that. must I be a teenager in love? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So you can intersperse that. Mm-hmm. You should have belted that out while we were. I thought about it. Was a little it. fast, though. It was a little fast. But... Oh, I could do it. <laughs> I could do it. Wow, okay. You know, tomorrow morning is uh, Guitar for Duffers. Don't forget it's that. It's another 11 duffy o'clock. It's another morning. duffer. Every it's three another duff- duffy We morning. duff three mornings a week here <laughs> at Camp Possum. <Awesome. laughs> uh, <laughs> well, let's see. There's a lot. Of, speaking of gay. Uh, Not one of my favorite ones. Too hard. <laughs> <laughs> is it that hard on fiddle? Is Kim is the hardest? Is it? Oh, it's, 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 it's in the great, Harding book. It's a beautiful melody. I didn't know that. It's a, it was set as a clog. That makes sense. The Harding book is an Irish tune. I would say. The Harding book is an Irish tune. It is? Alright. Yep. Harding's Jigs and Reels. All right. Okay. So, let us play it. Let us play another one, <laughs> shall we? I've almost worked through my list of uh, backup tunes. Of, you know, so I've got well, one no, more. I've got a ton of tunes here that you haven't played yet. No, it's honey, not. Not. But maybe not. Just the waltz you shaved for me is the you only one left. You played Boys Around the World already? Yes, so that was right, right, early maybe. on. Early on, early on, we played that. Did we play Chicken Straw? <laughs> we did. We played that during the patron oh, role. Remember, that's we always. Did. We did. Yeah, we played. Play I, chair. I've, I've, I know which ones we played, sweetie. All Let's right. play a little bit of the Ripple Rock Jig. I love that one. Walter plays that. I bet he'll play along with us. Oh, he will. Yep. Oh, I've got Indeed. messages. I haven't checked. Hang on. Hang on. No, 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 no. I'm thinking about Here we go. I'm not, I'm not, here we go. Huh. Add minor chords. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of minor chords you can add, Michael, on, the, on that last tune. Oh, yeah. But as we all know, there's no minors. On a bass. There's on no minors bass. on a bass. Everybody knows yeah. that. Yeah. If you want to know what they are, I'll send them to you. Right. Yeah. D. One note on this one note on the uh, drops over on the D one time, but that's an incredible amount of music for just on two strings mostly, isn't it? Mm-hmm. That's a well constructed tune. Ned Landry, that's one of his compositions. It is. Yeah, yeah. So uh, let's play. Uh, well, oh, uh, Brenda's reel. Yeah, I love I've that. Lost let's, everything. let's play Brenda's reel. My stupid phone. Oh, okay, maybe there it is. 
Brand is real. There'll be another ten tunes from my secret, oh, my well, secret Michael's, list. Michael's on guitar, not bass tonight. So there are minors. On there are minors guitar. on a guitar. I got my minors secret list of three hundred oh, tunes I'm pulling tune? from here. What was the tune? Oh, swinging on a gate. So I do different substitutions every time, Michael. I'll try to send you what I'm doing. Yeah. It's gonna be epic. Brenda's Bell Thomas Lamplighters is a clock. Okay, I think I'm. We're gonna play. We're gonna play. Brenda's real now. Ripple Rock rocks. It is rocks too. Look up what the Ripple Rock is. It's a geographic thing out in British Columbia. DNA. DNA. Two keys. Yes, two keys, D and A. Second part's an A. That's a good tune. Really yeah. good tune. It is a good tune. That's Canadian. That's uh, Carl, what's his name? A guy from Nova Scotia recorded that uh, back in the 50s. Shoot. What's, what's his Friend name? Friend is Real. Friend is Real. That's what we just played. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. Okay. <laughs> Never my mind. Phone. Oh, man. My phone Oh, man. Is you gotta not. ring the bell. Thomas, what? he just went crazy. Thomas just went crazy. Yeah, my phone He's is just crazy. Not. He just went nuts, man. Woo! He went hog wild. Chicken? <laughs> you eat a chicken too. Oh, chicken. that's what a super chat looks like right there, man. I, woo my phone's doing nothing. <sighs> he just went nuts, man. No. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. All I see is circling on my phone. It's circling. Circling? What do you mean? You mean yeah, give, look at give, it. Give it here. You're yeah. not even on the right page. I can tell. <laughs> oh, you're not. You're not I even on the right do you know how to open your YouTube app? Maybe. Maybe not. <laughs> Want to use my phone? It's the Kit Press Wednesday night session, isn't it? Yes. But <sighs> it might but it could be you could be trying to look at an old one. See that's the problem. I got no Not idea. the live stream. <laughs> I got Pat, no it's idea. funny. It's always funny with you, Pat. Alright, let's play a couple more here and then we're gonna I head on out of here. Chat now, but I got Brenda no is the cool Karen. <laughs> It's horrible. <laughs>
Oh, he's done it before. He's oh, super yeah. chatted before. Many times before. Back in the day. Chats. Back in the, yeah. in the early yes. days of the program, he was a, a frequent yeah. super chatter. Yeah. <laughs> when the big fiddle show empire, media empire, was just <laughs> t sending its tentacles out to conquer the world. Yes, indeed. <laughs> All right, I was going to play a little bit of Jimmy Gilmore's 50 Years Ago Waltz mm. in the key of D and G. D and G. Yes. Okay. Or we could play the 40 years ago waltz in the B flat. Which would you prefer? I don't care. We'll play D the 50 years. 50 we'll years do 50. Ago. It does that kind of thing. A lot of chords, dear. Study on Amelia, I believe. I'll have to send send me a message about reminding me to play Amelia. And you know where to send That's, that message, Kim? I want you to send that message to me at. This I want you to send it to me at. Tune, right? Yeah, it is. Send it to me at bigfiddleshow at gmail.com, Kim, and I will remember. I'll remember to put warm up on that tune. I got to do a little studying up on that tune. 
Yeah. All right, so I think we're going to play one uh, one more. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Joseph. All right. Yeah, thanks. Michael, that's a, that's a great tune. Go nuts 50 years ago, Walt. On the chords and waltzes, but it's all formulaic. You just got to know the formulas. Most of the time, yeah. Most of the but time. A lot of, lot, of, lot, of, lot of times you can follow a pattern. You know? well, yeah, the stuff that, that he plays. But we know Amelia's waltz. For sure. It's Bob McClellan. Yeah, but I couldn't play it tonight. No, I need to practice it, though. Yeah, I think that's, I what, I, that's what I'm it. saying. That's point, what I'm saying. I can always sing it. And I like, you know, another waltz I write is the Coming Through the Rye. I like that She waltz. says, I'll only call the hotline. <laughs> She'll, okay, we'll call the hotline then. <laughs> <laughs> call the, call the, what, what's the hotline number, folks? What, who wants to know that? There it is, 847-920-7587. Operators are standing by. Please call our hotline. Leave us a message. You can, Kim calls the hotline all the time. I, you, know, you can call day or night. It doesn't matter. They're there taking your messages right now. Call the hotline, folks. All right. uh, yeah, Tom, Tom says <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, Taylor McBain Waltz. Right. But Taylor yeah. played that a bunch. Yep. Yep. Festival Waltz, yes, it's a great waltz. We'll, yeah, we'll play that next waltz. time. We'll play that on yes. Saturday, maybe. That's fun, Charlie's. I like to, I used to play it in contests all contest the time. Contest tunes. So I think we're going to play one more and get on out of here, kids. Cleo Persinger's, Persinger's Horn Fight. Yeah, next time. Cleo Persinger's Horn Fight. I'm not sure which one he called Cleo Persinger's we'll Horn Fight. We'll find out, Alan. I'll have to sort that we'll out. We'll find out. Uh, I don't remember him calling a tune that, so that there might have been another tune that people associated with him and called that. So if you know what it is or you have a uh, recording of it, send it to me. I'll try, I, I bet I'll know what it is, but I don't know it by that title. So we're going to play one more here, kids. Let's play a little bit of that Johnny Don't Come Home Drunk in D. Ponytail, no but I've got a good mullet. I've got a good, I've got a fine mullet going. <laughs> yep, got, a, got a fancy mullet going. Here. Oh, he's got a very fancy. Kim says she's already called the hotline once. I know she's well, called. Well, you it once. You gotta call the hotline, folks. I'm gonna give yeah. that number out one more time. You gotta be persistent. I'm gonna give that number out. Well, eight four seven nine two zero seven five eight seven. Call it anytime sure. you want. Yeah. Call it anytime you want. All right, folks, we're gonna head on out of here, Pat. It's time to clear out. Let me get you. We're it's time to clear out. I'm going to show you. Here we go. Get ready. All right. Everybody. There it is. Bow to your partner. Hey, thanks everybody for coming and tonight. To your corner. Thanks. So, Join your hands and start to the lab. Well, it's the it's other way back to the same old track. Make your feet go yeah, wiggly wag. Then stop and swing yeah, when you get home. Dance your weight and swing your own. Promenade the home. Promenade. Make your feet go wickety whack, everybody. <laughs> Do it, Thanks. Good night, everybody. First I don't lady, have a slide